What's going on, everyone? Welcome. Wait, what's, going <laughs> what's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Eating the Dolls channel. First of all, thank you so much for having. Me. No, thank you for having me on your channel. Thank you, cause like you could have been like, girl, bye. Girl, she don't pull in these. You guys have no idea how much I love Rich Lugs. We filmed a video for Rich's channel. Um, if you guys want to check that out, the link will be in the description for your channel as well. And Thank you. we split a lot of tea. Yeah, we did. We split a lot of tea. <laughs> you basically told me that you wanted to uh, talk about trans and <laughs> my trans experience. His trans experience. Oh my god! And you wanted to tell my audience about that. He's transgender. Like, <laughs> she is trans now, and we have to refer to her as, um, what's your trans name? Rich. Oh. <laughs> it's like he was telling me that he has a whole bunch of trans stories, and yeah. that you're gonna tell me a lot of stuff that I'm gonna gag, so I, I'm expecting to gag in this video. Oh, yeah. Grab a snack, the like button, and comment, because it's going down. Oh, I see a dislike. <laughs> There's a dislike right there. You thought you were trans at one point. At one point, I thought I was trans the house. Okay, so let's talk about this because this is, I didn't know this would be sure. my trans experience. So here's how it went down. So I'm not gonna say no names, but a friend of mine would cross dress. She would cross dress all the time and she would get trade. This is when I was like broke, living like on the floor. I would go visit. Oh, yeah, edit that out. Oh my god, no! I would go visit my friend and then. <laughs> And I would be on the couch, Craig would come to the door, and then my friend would walk over there to the door, open it, in little pantyhose and a skirt. It was sickening, man. Like, oh, for, like they look like basketball That's players. They look like, Daddy. like, and this is when I, because I kind of, I was learning, and he, the difference is, when you're gay, and you date like another gay guy, you're kind of like a little feminine and stuff, but then like, if you're cross-dressing or trans, the men is totally different. Oh, it's like straight men. A man, honey. What did you do? <laughs> okay, now hold on. So then, my friend would literally take three hours to get in mug, like from a man to cross dress, right? Because he wasn't trying to, he was just cross dress. So he'll look like a female, and I was like, girl, you don't need to spend three hours in makeup. Like, they don't care. These guys don't care. And she was like, I, are they? I was like, I'm gonna show you. It doesn't matter. So back then. We were posting ads. It was this website, okay. but it wasn't for like monetary exchange. Like it was just like it for, was just for hook up. Just a hook up, like yeah, yeah. online dating, basically what it was. And I was like, let me prove to you that I'm gonna outdo you, bitch. Okay. I'm gonna be more training you. Cause she's like, and they're, oh, gonna, no, be, you they're have, gonna be more. Like, I had to do all this makeup. Yeah, yeah. All this. She would it's contour, so like she would really like pull out her feminine features and then put on the wig and look like a woman and then take the picture and the guys would come, come, come. I mean, it was like men and they were so beautiful guys. How many guys per day? It was just like until they had enough, like I'm done. You know, because the thing, the thing with guys is that once they, once they like relieve themselves, like they're like done for the day, but my friend wouldn't. So he was like ready to get more and more and more. Oh, so she would send one out and then the next one was already oh, like, no, waiting they for were, them? Oh, no, in the parking lot. Yeah, they were waiting like in the garage. So I grabbed my friend's phone and I was like, look, I put on some like, like a, like a pinky type, like this, like little pinky lip. And I put on some little lashes, full beard, and I put on a wig and threw it on, you know, little shake and go. Full beard. Full beard. Mustache too. And I would take the picture like this, post it, and then guys would hit me up. And my friend was like, no, no. Yeah. And I was like, I telling you, and we knew other like cross dressers in the city. And like, I bet you, as soon as he's done here, he's gonna go over to their house and they go over to the other girl's house. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like guys would come out of the door and I would be like my little wig, little busted ass lash. And then my friend was just like, crap, I gotta go hide in the closet. All right, so the guy would come in and, and like, I would knew, like this is my first time and I was like, hey. Like that's like, hey, my friend laughs cause that's not even like a real girl voice, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, hey, what's up? My old voice. <laughs> I actually learned that that kind of turned them off. Like the, the, the oh, squeaky did? feminine thing, they didn't really live for it. Did you get your turn? Oh yeah. You got fudge boots? No, they wanted me to top them. Mm-hmm, and then, and then they went down on me. So they wanted you to be a man. But they didn't say that like in the convo. They would just come over and they're like, oh, you're so beautiful. You're so um, beautiful. So they catfished you, honey. But they were like cute looking guys. They were like straight guys. I was like, wow, it is a totally different, like, my mind was blown. It's hard. Yeah, you be sucking dick. You're taking up the ass. You ain't straight, honey. <laughs> I feel like if you're transgender, you're a woman. Point blank. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I feel like you're a woman too. Oh, I mean, people say I'm a woman in the house. When you do transition, when you do, <laughs> when I do get that phone call in one year. Oh my god. I'll take it 
take you to get pumped. We'll go I want big room. hips like Nikita. <laughs> <laughs> this is when I noticed that there was like the dark side to it because I was just doing it just for like get your kicks off, get your rocks get off. Fun, you know? you know, this is how I knew I'm not um, trans because I was doing it just for sexual. I didn't feel and want to be a woman all the time. You know, there's a difference. You gotta like talk to yourself. Do you, are you doing this because you want to be a woman or are you doing it for like sexual, like whatever. So it started off like with my friend like competing and I was like, oh my gosh, I think I'm trans. Because at the time all my friends were trans. I think, oh my God, if you like makeup, I'm trans. Yeah, you yeah, like I'm makeup, not. I'm trans. And I was, and I had to like really step back and be like, no, I'm not trans. This was just like fun. How passable can I be? How far can Did I go? Photos? Did you have any photos with you to the audience? Um, no, it was like a secret. Here's where like, it got kind of like dark because some guys I would meet and they were like beautiful men. I really liked them and they were really into me under the sheets. But then outside of that, they didn't want to talk to me. They won't be with me or anything. You know what I'm saying? After y'all fucked, it's like... Yeah, it's basically. Funny. And I was like, wow, this sucks for people who cross dress or trans women. The guys want to keep them under the cover. You, you know what I'm saying? I feel that way. But you don't get that vibe. Oh no, because you look like a woman, honey. I had a beard, so maybe that's what it was. You know what I'm saying? Because you're looking at me like, what? So one day, I put on my little busted little wig, my look, like looking like a man with just a wig on, and I would wear like a muumuu. You know what a muumuu is? What's a muumuu? It's just, like a long shirt. I like a little thong on, whatever. Wait, you <laughs> a bra? No, no bra. Okay, so you No bra, no bra. Because it doesn't matter, because I would just like, they would take it off anyway. So here I am with my wig on, and I would never pin it down with a cap. So here I am with this guy, now I bought him that time. He's like riding me, get on top. So I get on top, girl, and the wig falls off. <laughs> <laughs> and I have like a ball face, girl. <laughs> Might have been this wig right here too, I'm not sure. Because all the stuff wasn't mine, like it was my friend's stuff. Like I was like, you're not using this wig? So, like, no. Nope. Come on in and everything. <laughs> I'm like, girl, it probably has DNA on it now. I wouldn't even style it. Like, okay, <laughs> yeah, you see, and I, the wig started to slide back like this. But it fell off, and I was like, <gasps> How embarrassing. And I was like trying to like get the wig. He's like, nah, nah, leave, leave it off. It doesn't matter if you're so beautiful. You're a woman. You're a woman no matter what. And I was like, oh my god, my wig fell off. And he didn't even care. And guess what? My friend was in the corner watching. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes like they come and they want to tell you about like their life and stuff. Like they stay afterwards. And they want to spill all their tea with you. Basically. Yeah, I'm like a therapist. They're like, oh yeah, my girl don't do this. Like, you have a girlfriend in the house? It was so weird. But anyways, I proved to my friend that some guys just don't care. They don't have to be all dolled up. Now some did, because some was like, are you passable? And I would be like, well, anything's possible in the dark. <laughs> like a trans moment. So basically realize that you were a cross dresser and not a trans woman. Yeah, but in the beginning, I thought I was trans the house. <laughs> at least you tried. So at least I tried sure. it. You know, at least I tried it for not. sure. But I can say that being like dressed up, it, you get stuff oh, men. I can even describe to you some of the men. Have you ever been with a trans guy? Uh huh. They didn't have like the. They still had their part. Okay. They still had the you know thing. I was shocked because. You went on a date or did you? Was, it was, was a skating way? rink, and I went up to him and I was like, "Hey, I get your number. I get your number." I got on the phone and he was like, "I just want to say something." I'm. I'm trans. Like, so you were born a female and now you're a guy. Yeah, but how did you know he was gay? I, I, walk, I didn't, I just walked up to him. Like, I'm very bold. Anyone will tell you, I walk up to people and I'm like, can I have your number? What's his name? La Chacha? No! <laughs> no, not at all. No, no, no. Never, girl. <laughs> I'm so woman over here. <laughs> okay, so my verdict here is you're not trans. I'm not. But you are, um, a C D D D D. <laughs> you can still be a woman. Yes, the house. When you're, you know, when you want to feel the moment. You feel the like, fantasy. The fantasy. Yeah. It's just so crazy that there is a very big difference between trans and cross dressing. I feel like people don't talk about cross dressers. The how. That's a really big point that I want to talk about too. Is that like a lot of boys? Ever since Kate and Jenner came out, everyone's trans all of a sudden. You know what I mean? Yeah, that was and a big. Oh, you wear makeup? You're trans. Like that's not. The if case. you like makeup, you're trans. If yeah. you like the color pink, you're trans. Oh my yeah. god, I'm trans. I'm a woman. Yeah. If that's not what it is, being trans is much more than dressing up. So it's more than just makeup. <laughs> the house. It's what's in your heart, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, but would you do it again? Oh, the house! Do you still do it today? Not as much. When was I asking you to? Yes, last night. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for being on my channel, Rich. I really appreciate it. Thank you for having me. I just want to hug you. Thank you so much. Give me so much. Guys, I want to give a huge thank you and shout out to oh, my Teresa. good Judy, hey. Teresa Rover, who set this all up for us. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And until next time, bye, guys. Bye. Comment, rate, subscribe. Love you so much. Bye. Bye, guys.
Shine. 